Morning guys. Had another job today. Plenty of weeds like this. And lots of moss, etc etc. The edges are quite overgrown. Um, yeah, as I said, the edges are quite overgrown. There's quite a lot of weeds everywhere. It's quite a large job. Quite a good sized driveway. And it is, yeah, pretty dirty. I mean, you can see the discoloration everywhere. Um, but I think underneath this is probably a really nice driveway. And first job of the day. I've been told that she's quite worried about getting water into the garage. And I imagine this is why. <laughs> so I'm going to get the gloves on and uh, yeah, dig this down as far as it seems to go. I think it's just soak away, but um, yeah, I'm going to try and get everything I can out of there. But yeah, I mean, that is clogged. So yeah, like and subscribe, the usual, you know, and uh, look, there's some more more grassy, rubbishy weeds. Bin's just filling up. I'm tripping over stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna get this um, crapola out of the uh, drain and we'll see how much there is. I bet there's quite a bit. God, it's rock solid in there. I might actually have to get a uh, some kind of scraper. I'll be back. Oh. Right. There's actually roots growing in here, so there might be a bit of a root ball, which is uh, probably from these hedges, things like that. God. Oh, you can hear it all breaking up. I might even see if she's got an extension lead and try and hoover this out because there's so much. It's actually quite hard to get out because it's so wedged. I mean, that would explain her drainage issues anyway. I don't even know how deep this drain is, but there's a lot of old roots and things like that. So there's something growing through there, which isn't the best. Yeah, this could be a few minutes. Even worms living in there. Oh, God. Poor worm. I didn't mean to slam him against the wall like that. God, how deep does this root go? I found a tap root of some kind. God. Look at all this. I don't know how well you can see down there, but there's a lot of roots. Let me see if there's a plug in here. Don't want to be too nosy, but it'd be good to get some power. There's a fridge there. Um, Hmm. There's no extension leads about either. I'm gonna have to just do this by hand. I was gonna see if I could plug in my Hoover, but if if there is a plug, um, there's no extension lead, and I haven't brought one, so I have to just keep digging.
Right, we're hitting gravel now, so that must be near the bottom of the soak away. There was a massive root growing through the middle of it though. I don't know where it's coming from, but it's an absolute beast and I can't even get it out from this angle. I mean really, to me it seems like it needs redigging and redoing. Because there's so much in there. I can't even... Oh, okay, I can see where the roots go. Oh god. Okay, I found the outlet for the soak away. <coughs> Outlet's running that way, and there's just a root ball, like cluster of roots like that, sticking out this way of the outlet. So I'm gonna have to uh, see if I can pull those out one way or another. Oh, they're so firmly in there, though. God. Still digging underneath them as well. I've no idea where these roots are going from. I mean, they're mass. It must be going on for a long way. This root. God. God. I can't even break the root, it's so huge. But I mean, at least in terms of gravel, we're like breaking it down. But this root is so thick, it's filled the entire pipe. So, you can probably see a bit better now. That's the end of the root cluster, but this, this root is so thick, it's filled the whole diameter of a, uh, Three or probably a four inch, I think it's a four inch pipe. Oh, let me see if there's another access anywhere. Oh God, if there is, it's under there. I mean, this is probably our culprit here. Oh, there is a drain. But it's right under all that behind this spiky bush. Let's speak to the customer. All right, guys. Um, yeah, I spoke to the customer about it. There is a manhole cover, so I'm gonna see if I can possibly lift that. And have a look but I mean I don't think I'm gonna be able to get the roots myself not today anyway so yeah I'll let the customer know and that's all I can do
guys. So I've been here almost an hour and all I so far all I've cut in is around there and I've sort of given that a rough going over with the turbo nozzle. I, uh, I definitely underestimated the uh, level of the weeds here. Um, they didn't look all that bad when I came to quote, it just looked like a few spot areas to deal with but they're everywhere and they're like severely severely rooted in like <coughs> Jesus Christ I mean I don't think it's been probably cleaned ever um, and I imagine it's quite an old driveway like the weeds are established like they've got thick tap roots and stuff like that so I have a lot of a uh, lot of effort on my hands I think I did quote for a weed treatment so but I mean even if I didn't I'm gonna do one even without being charged uh, without charging it because I mean they're gonna come back savagely if I don't so yeah deal with what we can but um, yeah I mean you can see underneath it's uh it's gonna come out quite nice a lot of red and yellow sort of colors um, but yeah the uh, customers just making me a cup of, cup of coffee so gonna stutter through my words this morning it seems but um, yeah I think it's probably the uh, dirtiest drive I've done like ever actually I think there's gonna be a lot of cleanup might be my second worst but yeah so stay tuned and enjoy <laughs> pretty gross and sweaty <laughs> horrible yeah so just laid the treatment down and you can see it's already working black spots are going white that's the telltale sign that it's happening so I'm gonna let this sit for a little bit I might wet it up a little bit more but basically it's working fine um, that drain from this morning um, discovered there's a major route running from there all the way up and there's a manhole over there which is slightly blocked oh. Oh, sorry that's strong I haven't changed the uh, the uh, proportion of since yesterday so it's still on like major strength um, but I mean at least it's working quick I'll rinse down in a minute yeah, there's a route going all the way along there. I lifted a manhole and yeah, it was it was blocked. There was a, you know, like a little bit of sewage in there and stuff, but 
I uh, I ran my Jetta through where the route is just to sort of basically like clean off the route. Let me get into the drive, the road. It's pretty horrible. Here. I hate that smell when it's that intense. It's like burning my nostrils. Christ. I'm not gonna remind myself to uh, change that back tonight. God, it's stinking. But yeah, um, yeah, I ran the Jetta through and that basically just cleaned out all the rubbish. And uh, yeah, it's sort of draining nice now, so I'm gonna rinse this all down. But I'm gonna break it into two sections because there's an area by the front door where you see that path where it basically dips and it's just puddling around there. So I'm gonna let that drain and then I'll soft wash that. I don't have a huge amount of battery. This is my last one for the day, but I mean, I'm only gonna rinse down now and then that'll be it really. Like I'll be done for the day. So yeah, enjoy. actually but I don't think it's too late but yeah that was one hell of a job just packed up the van it's very full I really need to get my trailer set up built slash bigger van I don't know but yeah this is the result anyway pretty happy with this um, there were some dramas because like the drainage was such a problem because the only drain was blocked and there's a massive root in there which I can't get out so that was a drama all day. Um, had to unblock it a couple of times. And um, yeah, I've lifted up various different manholes. There's about three or four different ones. I mean, there's one there, two, there's one down there, and there's one over there. There's four that I know of. And uh, yeah, I've lifted several of them. And uh, yeah, definitely block drain anyway. Like, I know there's a route there. The frustrating thing is, I can't get it out with the, what I have. Um, 
Well, well, I say that I could, but I don't have a long glove, like shoulder glove, and I'm not reaching my hands into the drain because there is sewage in there. So, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, just waiting for these last bits to drain. This area is done. Um, yeah, it's not much more to say really. Um, I'll be back in the morning to resand it, so the next clip will be that. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the morning. Yeah.